this is the card I'll be showing you how to make today. It's using the Wonderful World stamp set here. Um, this is from the 2022 Summer Celebration. Um, super cute um, stamp set. Um, I was kind of inspired by this card um, from a teammate of mine. I received a swap from her, Blair Collins. Um, but this was her card. Um, super pretty. But I wanted to put a little extra twist on mine, so um, I came up with this one. Um, but it's using one of my kind of new favorite um, products that Stampin' Up! has, the um, masking paper. Um, and so, to get started, we'll start with a um, three by four and a quarter sheet of Whisper White um, I have here. Now, I took a three and a quarter by three and a quarter sheet of the masking paper and I took my paper cutter and cut it in half so that I would have two pieces like so two triangles and then I just took the back sticky off and stuck it on either side of my whisper white um, three by four and a quarter sheet of paper here um, and I stuck it down to just scrap paper um, because I'm going to be using some blending brushes. So I've got Fresh Freesia, Freesia ink here and gray granite. I'll start with my gray granite and just ink up here and then start on the masking paper and kind of start circulating and then work onto my paper to help um, make sure there's no streaks or crazy lines in my um, brush here. So once, I've done, uh, once I'm done with the gray granite, I did that kind of down the center. I'm going to go in with my fresh freesia and go on the top and the bottom and add some purple. Okay, once you've finished that, you can close up your ink pads here. And then you'll just um, grab your Blackberry Bliss and my um, little flower stamp here from the, um, the Wonderful World stamp set. Um, and we'll leave the masking paper down and we'll just go ahead and stamp our flowers all along in the center here and on the sides. There we go. So once we're completely done using the blending brushes to add a background color and doing or uh, stamping this image, our image, we can go and peel away the um, masking paper. So one thing that I've noticed is with a very pigmented color, you can also easily add fingerprints. So after you peel away your masking paper, I would grab a wipe or something and just wipe off the tips of your fingers to hope, hopefully alleviate any extra fingerprints you may add. So throw away your scrap paper because you don't need that anymore. And then I grabbed this You Are My Friend from the True Beauty stamp set here and grabbed my Blackberry Bliss ink again. And I will just stamp that right here in the corner, like so. And then um, I took a five and a half by eight and a half sheet of Fresh Freesia and folded it in half and added um, some linen uh, thread here and tied a little loose bow. Um, I also, use the deckled re rectangle dies and um, die cut one of them out of some Blackberry Bliss. Um, and that's what I'm going to layer my three by four and a quarter sheet that I just did the masking technique on. So go ahead and glue that on to your Blackberry Bliss piece here. And then I added some dimensionals on the back. 
And then we can just slide that right underneath the linen thread here and line it up. Whoops, it decided to stick on me. There we go. Alrighty, and we'll move my linen thread down here just a smidge so you can see the greeting. But there's the finished card, super pretty. Um, really cool technique using the masking paper. Um, but I love the colors and I loved how it turned out. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.